First at four, Chico State's Academic Senate passed two ceasefire resolutions concerning the Israel-Hamas war in response to student protests over the conflict. Action News Now reporter Camille Acevedo is live at Chico State. Camille, how did the vote play out? Well, Linda, the vote came out to a 28 to 4 decision, and it took the Senate three meetings to finalize the two resolutions that I'm holding right here in my hands. And the first resolution calls for bilateral cessation of conflict in the Middle East. The second resolution is six pages long. It calls for a reaffirming commitment to academic freedom, First Amendment protections for anti war demonstrators, objecting to current aggression in Gaza, condemning human rights violations, and a call for a bilateral ceasefire and peace in the Gaza Strip. Now these are resolutions which are really just an, an opinion of the Senate body. This doesn't have any binding effect, but they felt like rendering an opinion uh, was something that they wanted to do. Uh, and given the national attention of the situation, that it was important that they be provided with an opportunity to speak freely on the topic. Changes were made to both resolutions. The Senate added the word bilateral to the title for the first resolution and for the second, changes were made surrounding language use around anti-Semitism and what defines genocide. And Trailer says that there was a lot of public involvement within the last meetings and that in the last meeting there was like over 200 people in attendance for that. Live in Chico, I'm Camille Osvedo for Action News Now coverage you can count on. All right, thank you Camille. We were following that very closely last week and so it's good to know the outcome. Now, uh, from what we understand, the Academic Senate approved those resolutions on May 9th.